So you're getting 4K capture, and you're going straight from the sensor right to ProRes, right? So you're immediately going to the workhorse, industry standard codec, and you're not transcoding, you're getting it originally, you're getting it raw. Sensor, uncompressed 422 stream, ProRes, right, in 4K. And you'll be able to do it in a, in a cost-effective way, because what we do is we record to non-proprietary media. What it is, is it's simply a two and a half inch drive, right? So all we do is we give you a plastic caddy, allows you to put it in there, screw it in, and then move it around from place to place. And so you can get a spinning disc with a rated array that we'll have later, or you can go uh, SSD. Yeah, so you've got a couple of power options. You've got, first you've got uh, our Sony type compatible batteries, right? You've also got, we have a dummy battery for DTAP, which will allow you to get a PTAP cable in for Anton Bauer. We've also got a uh, DC in for either coming up the wall or coming from our new uh, power station. So what this guy does is he allows you to have a continuous power supply to all sorts of things. Right now it's got a uh, it's got a DC in, so we can charge the batteries, or it's got a DC out, two DC outs. One can go into a dummy battery here that charges, now it's now running this camera. So we'll have dummy batteries for the A7S, the GH4, the, the uh, GH3, the uh, 5D Mark III, many other cameras. And then the, D, the uh, DC in can also go, the DC out can also go to the DC in here. And now you're powering both devices with one set of batteries. So you can go as long as you've got batteries. As long as you've got charged batteries, boom, swap it in, swap it out, swap it in, swap it out and you just never run out. You can record as long as you've got media. And you can get a lot of media in here, right? And so, the uh, because it's very affordable. On top of that, you know, when you put a rated array on here, you can get, like, say, two terabytes. Even in 4K, 30p, that's five hours continuous recording. ProRes.mov, we also have DNX HD. Uh, on top of that, we'll do Cinema DNG. We'll do raw recording from an FS700 and from a uh, C500 and potentially more options in the future. You can go to pull up vector scopes, waveforms, punch in, two to one punch in, one to one so you can nail your focus because 4K, you don't get 4K unless it's in focus, right? So that's what that allows you to do. You've also got the full HD screen which allows you to focus on the fly. It's a calibrated screen, calibratable screen with the spider. We've got a, a, pair, uh, a partnership with Datacolor. So you can keep it in calibration over the lifetime of the product. This is 1995 US, 1499 Euro. So very, very affordable. But you couldn't find a better scenario. Right now I mean if you were to combine you field monitor, it's okay. Exactly. And that's the thing, is if you were to go around here and find a great monitor, right, and look at the cost of that and take that off of here and you go and you get a 4K recorder. Right? It's it's huge. So uh, game changer is what we're going for, game changer.